Hello, Dan Townsley here with another fur cut trip tip. Today I have a quick demonstration of how to convert a pass-through point to a stop with no duration. The value of this is that you can place more stops in your route and have them exported as waypoints uh, in your GPX files, uh, but they will not have a duration uh, while in fur cut, so they don't impact your trip plan time. So I've got a route here uh, that has a number of pasture points in it, and one of those I'm going to convert now to a stop with no duration. So I select my pasture point, and I locate it, uh, open up its properties. I see that it uh, has the pasture point icon and no duration. So what I want to do now is go back to the icon, or pass through and select a new icon. It can be anything as long as it's not a pass through. So I select other. I like the flag. Um, notice there is still no time. So this is now a stop with zero duration. I'm going to change the name here so that I can follow it through to my GPX file uh, just to demonstrate how it gets exported. So I save this and I now have a stop added to my route plan and I see it here in my plan list. Uh, I can double check that by uh, changing my filter to just show stops and sure enough it comes up as a stop now not a pass through point. It still has a zero duration time. So now if I want to export this um, I can do so uh, I export as uh, GPX files all the time. In this case, I'm going to use the new Garmin uh, GPX route export facility. So I select my Garmin route export. I always export tracks along with my routes. They're my backup. Uh, I'm going to change this to uh, no additional appended points. And I'm going to export. So this will download now to my computer. And then I'll open this file up in my text editor to show you the GPX data. Um, here you see the file name that I exported, which is my trip name. Um, here are the waypoints uh, that were the stops and my track and my route uh, along with them. I'm going to open up a few here just so you can see the GPX information. It's just text, and the text is bounded by some tags that tell devices and applications how to use this information. Uh, as you can see here, this is my pass-through point that I converted to a stop. Um, the name uh, right at TMs. And uh, now I'm done. This has uh, hopefully been a value add and I'll talk to you next time.